Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. I just got to say this to my beautiful black people, to my beautiful black brothers and sisters. We going to have a serious discussion tonight about basically the direction we need to go. They have sent a message to us, these high-end fashion companies. They don't want us rocking their shit. We barely a week and a half removed from the Gucci incident. And you would think that nobody could top the Gucci, you know, with the black face sweater. But hold on. Guess what? Blurberry was like, nah, we can one up y'all. Blurberry had the audacity to put out a hoodie that had a noose around it. That's right. A noose. Let me guess. They did they missed the mark. They didn't mean to offend anybody. You know, they're going to try to do more research. They're going to have more diversity when it comes to their hiring. Look, I don't want to hear this shit no more. It's a Blurberry store in Livermore, California. I'm going right down there on Friday and I'm going to ask them how in the fuck could y'all had known hadn't had known that this would be offensive. I'm gonna ask for the manager and I don't give a fuck what happens if they kick my ass out or arrest my ass because I'm going down there. I didn't had enough of this shit. They didn't made it clear, ladies and gentlemen, black people, they don't want us rocking they shit. They telling us we didn't make our shit for you niggas. We don't care if you endorse it on your raps or not. We don't want y'all wearing our shit. Now, the question is, we all know what's going to happen. Who's going to be the first nigga that's going to put on a coon cape and, and, and try to save and make excuses for Blurberry? I guess Floyd, I guess Floyd going to take his bitch ass to Blurberry and buy like 200 racks worth of Blurberry shit. I know because he's not a uh, he not a follower. I guess Brother Polite going to come with a whole graph chart about Blurberry. I guess, uh, you know. Kodak Whack is gonna say, I'm like it, blah, blah, baby. Okay, what y'all think y'all be reaching? So I guess we reaching with this, right? And I don't wanna hear nobody don't know nothing about the history of lynchings because they trying to play that role. Oh, we don't know the history of blackface bullshit. Keep in mind, white people tell us every day how much smarter they are than us, how intellectually superior they are. Black people, we gonna have a serious discussion on my live stream tonight. You know what I'm saying? We gonna talk about this, real talk. Um, I'm going to be completely honest with you. This is just real talk. I know I have non-black subs. You know what I'm saying? It, it, but I'm going to ask y'all to take a back seat because this is just something we got to discuss among us black people. It's time to start shutting these motherfucking stores down. Enough is enough. It's time to start calling these companies. It's time to start like shutting these fucking stores down. They just blatantly keep slapping us in the face. They, they just do it right before our eyes and give us the finger. And you know why they do it? Cause like I said, they know niggas like Floyd, you know what I'm saying? Kodak Black, you know what I'm saying? Brother Polite, or should I say Sucker Polite, is gonna cape for them. When do we say enough is enough? Black people, we gotta, we gotta stop this. How much disrespect is we supposed to take? I mean, this is just just ridiculous. They just blatantly doing it right before our eyes saying, hey, fuck y'all niggas straight up. Anybody that wear Blurberry, man, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to look at you sideways because you know what I'm saying? That's just real talk. A hoodie with a noose around it. I don't want to hear none of that shit. They don't know about the history of, uh, of a noose because AKA they used to call it back in the day, a picnic. AKA pick a nigga the lynch. And fuck any of you niggas that's gonna come on here, you coons trying to say we complain too much and we make it a big deal. Nah, fuck that. Nah, fuck that. We didn't had enough of this shit. They got it. You know what? They got a Burberry store in Livermore. I think I'm gonna get him a call tomorrow. Anybody that's from the Bay Area, if you happen to be in Livermore, they got a Blurberry store in that mall uh, going towards Tracy, that outlet mall. 
do me a favor if you can if you in that area go in there and ask to speak to the manager don't go in there screaming and cussing ask them what's up with this stuff because i think i'm gonna pay them a visit like this weekend so real talk black people we gonna have to have a discussion on the live stream about these clothing companies i mean enough is enough but anyway i'm out <laughs>